sub four average of five, sub three single, and counting a world record time. Is this possible? Kyle Santushi's answer is yes. He just got a 3.96 keyboard average of 5 with a 2.96 single and a counting 3.13 single, which if you didn't know is the world record time, and a 3.66, also counting. The third fastest solve in the average is a 3.66, absolutely amazing by Kyle Santushi. Let's break down this average. The first solve is the 366. Kyle's gonna go for yellow cross here. His cross pieces are here, 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 and here. And he's just gonna go for uh, a very quick, very, very quick, quick. Jesus Christ, I can't speak English today. Uh, very quick cross. First of all, inserting this a green edge relative to these two, like so. And planning our first pair, which is these two. So you can notice that if we bring these two up, this will be uh, a free pair. So, doing this and bring up the orange and inserting these at the back, a very, very efficient uh, cross plus one. And then uh, the second pair is also a free pair right here. So he just rotates and does these two. And now here, he has this pair and he has this pair. And he had, does a very cool technique here where basically he cancels, uh, he, sorry, he pairs up this pair and cancels into a sledgehammer. Because if we just normally do this, this will be a pretty bad pair. But here, we can actually cancel into the sledgehammer to solve this as a free pair. I actually made a short about this uh, before. We can solve this into its slot and then just OLL, PLL. Uh, for this OLL, you can basically recognize uh, PLL very easily. This will go to here, this edge will go to here, and this edge will go to here. The corner patterns will not change. So this is a GB perm. I'll just go straight into this and a 13.11 TPS solve. Uh, brilliant solving by Kyle Santushi. The F2L was extremely efficient, and the last layer, of course, is just typical Kyle Santushi spam. 3.66 is only the third fastest solve in this average because the next solve, he got a 3.13, matching the world record time. Here, Kyle does uh, something on white cross. His cross piece is here, here, oh, I'm sorry, here, here, here and here and he does an x cross using this block and this edge so you can notice that we can bring up this block and solve this edge at the back simultaneously and then we can solve this blue edge and this orange edge like so and here Kyle also notices this pair so instead of doing something like this which will break these two up Kyle is deliberate about the order of solving this block and this edge doing R, F prime to make sure that these two are paired up. <coughs> and here's something he quite likely learned from Timon, doing a wide U prime instead of a D move and a rotation so that he can solve this pair into the back without any, uh, sorry, without any rotations. And we have a keyhole here with this corner and this edge. And we can also see that Kyle went for these two because it will also set up this final pair, like so, just straight into the back, and then just OLL, PLL, fat soon into J perm, a full step 3.13. Note that uh, the two three second solves in this average are both full step, which is absolutely crazy. And team and Kyle just pulls off a random 3.13 full step, absolutely insane. And we have our next solve, which is even more insane. It is a 2.96. Um, there, there have been less than, like, 10 sub-3 singles recorded on camera, and this is one of them. So, let's see how Kyle does this solve. Again, on yellow cross, cross pieces here, 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 and here, and Kyle's gonna do an X cross. So, normally, this is just a 3-move cross, like so. But Kyle notices this corner and this edge. So, you notice that after doing the B prime, you can do not only just do R2, but you can do insert a U move to pair these two up in the back and insert a U prime move to pair this up into a block also at the back, like so. And here we notice our uh, fourth, uh, second pair immediately. So we just do a Y D prime and solve these two. And finally we have a pseudo slotting. So uh, this corner and this edge are all solved. So all that's remaining is bringing over this empty slot all that's remaining is this pseudo pair, which he solves into the front. 
very, very brilliantly efficient uh, F2L, both the X Cross and the final pseudo slotting to finish, and a very, very lucky OLL F double sex E F prime into PLL skip, a brilliant 2.96. And now this average is already going great, and Kyle finish up this, uh, finishes up this average with two, again, brilliant uh, low five singles to get a 3.96 average of five. The fourth solve is the worst solve of the average, and it's a 5.26, which is quite amazing how 5.26 is the worst solve of the average. But let's see. On White Cross here, this is very, very easy. Here, 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 and here. This solve is just pure... Uh, Sorry, pure straight, a straight ahead C pop, uh, nothing too fancy. You can solve these, and finally, uh, that at the back. And then here, Kyle notices his first pair, which is these two. So he does this to pair them up at the back and insert. And here, Kyle notices a very nice pattern. So pairing these two up and uh, solving these because. That would give him this case. And what is special about this case is that it can very very quickly execute it. Because what he does for this pair is he, to insert this at the back. This edge at the back. And solve this corner into its slot using keyhole. And then just solving these. So that seems like a very, very high move count. But I think Kyle noticed that all of, the, all of this from the second pair and he just went straight into these with no pauses and all this is actually quite good uh, for execution if you try it out yourself and then here he does a sledgehammer to orient edges and a soon and just a perm again a full step solve brilliant by Kyle Santushi 10.84 TPS and a final solve to finish off the average and to get himself a uh, sub 4 average of 5 a 5.09 single so here again on white cross here, 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 cross pieces. We solve these relative to each, to each other. And then finally, this green one in the front, like so. Pretty standard, and we have our first pair right here. And here, Kyle does a uh, rotation to solve these two. And here, he also notices this pair at the front. And so, instead of doing something like this, which would leave a very bad fourth, uh, third pair, he does... He does U2, L prime U2L, to pair these two up and to solve in the front. So these nuanced solutions influencing uh, the later pairs are very, very are something that are very, very uh, crucial and you should implement in yourselves as well. And then just OLL and U PLL. You'll notice that throughout this average, except for the 2.96 single, every single solve is full step with a full step 3.13 a full step 3.66 uh a 3.96 average brilliant brilliant solving by kyle i hope to see more of this brilliant solving in the future i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one